Prish. Uh, uh, yeah. My question is like, uh, there was a uh, clipping on the television that showed that after 40th or 45th over, the, uh, the stitches were coming off and the ball had become soft and the commentator was saying, like we heard a lot about the PSG ball, so uh, did, uh, did it affect the bowler that it became soft with the early, the commentator was talking about it? Look over here, uh, the ball did become soft after a while and you know when the wicket is on the flatter side and <laughs> the bounce is less. So you can't, you are left with a limited option. So we were trying to figure out what we can do with the limited uh, things on hand at that time. But yeah, it was difficult when the ball becomes soft, the way, even if it uh, doesn't, uh, you know, shine really well because of the new COVID rules that we can't use the saliva. So it's very difficult during that times to, you know, maintain the ball. And so, yeah, it was, it was part of the whole thing. Hi, Mr. Can you hear me? Yes. Uh, right after lunch for that one hour, you guys applied a lot of pressure on England. Uh, the run flow was very limited of just coming at one run per over and the pressure was huge. But they both root and Don simply battled out and after that run stuck. So, uh, was it really frustrating that you applied so much pressure on, on such a flat surface but just couldn't get the rewards? Yeah, when uh, I think we, we bowled well in patches, we bowled uh, really well in patches, we created a lot of pressure. Uh, but from the last session, we gave few extra runs that we wanted to. Uh, we, I think we gave 20, 20, 30 runs more than we w what we wanted to. But yeah, this is how the game of cricket goes. So we'll uh, look to do the same thing tomorrow, create more pressure and hopefully more chances will be created. Yeah. Uh, just like, uh, are you surprised how flat the wicket is? Do you expect from the day you came here for the training session till now? How well should be changed? There is a box of it being very green. Yeah, so uh, I have not, this is my first match, so over here, uh, uh, it was on the flatter side, not uh, not a lot of lateral movement was there on the ball and the ball got scuffed up because the wicket was hard and dry. So yeah, uh, it was uh, it was a interesting first match for me over here. Yeah, so we, we are not trying to complain about how the wicket is, we are trying to figure out what are the options and how do we solve them. So we are looking uh, at the options that are there at hand and you know, try to create chances and try to uh, make as many chances as we can. Hi Jaspreet, uh, my question is about uh, particularly the, the body language we heard Rishabh Pant on the stump mic uh, uh, telling fielders, especially the fielders in the infield uh, to keep their body language up to create an atmosphere. Uh, do you feel like uh, you guys uh, were a little flat today in the field? Uh, I think we were okay uh, till the second session but in the beginning of the last session little bit here and there was there because when there are a lot of incentives coming when you take a lot of wickets then the body language is automatically up. So yeah sometimes in the heat it's difficult to keep the body language up but yeah after a while I think we were okay and then we were trying to put in a lot of effort and trying to create chances. Uh, Jaspreet, I wanted to ask you about like team selection. Uh, do you th uh, what was the rationale behind Kuldeep uh, not not being involved? Do you think a risk spinner would have on on day one been a bit more helpful or uh, like what was it? because Nadim had just come into the squad? So. Look, in hindsight, we can say a lot of things and there will be a lot of ifs and buts later on. But yeah, uh, this was the team uh, that we went up with and we back each and every individual. So yeah, in hindsight, we can see this and that after the game. But right now. There's still a job to be done and we are focusing on the things that we have to do and backing our players. So, yeah, later on after the game, we could, you know, discuss about all those things. Playing in Australia with crowds and then playing first match here without the crowd, does that somewhere affect the morale on the field? Look, it depends on individual to individual. For me, um, I don't look at, uh, I don't need um, extra support or extra noise to, you know, push and motivate myself. Uh, for me, it doesn't really hamper me but it's de it depends on individual to individual so yeah uh, that is a question to be answered by individuals yesterday joe root said that pujara will be a huge wicket for cricket so my question is looking at how root himself is batting and say his dismissal, dismissal will be a, the first thing india will be looking at in the early morning tomorrow Look, we every wicket is equally important. For us, uh, all wickets are equally important. We are not focusing on one particular individual. We picked up three wickets today. 
our main focus is to pick up seven wickets and we are focusing on that not a particular individual they've got very good players in their team so everybody uh, gets equal respect and everybody can take the game on their given day so we are focusing on that we are not focusing on one particular individual you just mentioned that uh, the, i mean uh, about the thing that you, uh, without saliva uh, to maintain the ball is a little bit of a challenge how big a challenge is that and what are the options available and is it really tough on uh, such kind of a flat wicket if you don't have that option so when the wicket is on the flatter side i said because of the new covid rules there are very limited options to shine the ball so in india the ball gets roughed up and to make the ball reverse you'll have to make one side heavy so sometimes with the sweat it doesn't really you know um, serve the purpose you can't make one side heavy and it doesn't really work that way so but this is uh, the rules of the game right now and we'll have to make do with what we have right now uh how they rate the road settings and when you bowled to him in the end england 2018 compared to that now did you notice any change in his approach uh it's it's you know it's very difficult to compare because when we were playing in england the ball is different the wicket is different the ball does a lot more and over here obviously he's come from sri lanka he's had good innings behind him as well he played very well he's he was sweeping and reverse sweeping he was um, while playing the spinners i had noticed that he was staying low and you know trying to read the trajectory very quickly so yeah full credit to him he played a very good innings and yeah there's no difference that i noticed from 2018 or 20 or uh, 21 right now because it's two different uh, arenas and two different situ- uh, different situations what do you think will be the ideal person score you'd like to no restrict them and how do you think the wicket will uh, change over the coming days will it help bowlers in terms of in terms of spin do you think there is chance that because we didn't see much today yeah it didn't spin a lot today but it's difficult to assess till both teams have bowled then we can make a call on how the wicket would change up we we can uh, assess the wicket as soon as uh, possible tomorrow our main purpose is to create more chances and create more pressure and then we will see one by uh, session by session one day at a time that how the wicket is changing and then we could adapt to, uh, to the wicket and probably make any changes to the plans if they are need to be what did you talk about your own performance it was exemplary today but this was probably your first match so wanted to understand from you what was different uh, like what you do outside india and what you have done in this match because you took three wickets so this was a special effort from you look for me uh, i have i have played in india this is not my first match in india yes first test match in india i have played first class cricket i have played heaps of cricket in india and i am from india so it's not completely alien i am i i do know what to expect on indian wickets yes the wicket was on the flatter side we were able to create pressure i was happy with my own performance today but still the job is to be done and then uh, right now my main focus is how do i help the team tomorrow and what what can i do to create more chances and give uh, the breakthroughs that are required for us